Hello! <laughs> Just want to start with that. Can I start with that? Hello! And then, uh, and then we all know where we are, because we all clicked the video. We know what we're watching, right? I can't, I can't leave it hanging, though. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more End of the Gun and Farewell to Arms. Oh, thank God. I got it off my chest. Welcome back to more uh, End of the Gun and Farewell to Arms. Let's, uh, let's, let's even it out by just saying the introduction three times. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more End of the Gun and Farewell to Arms. Has this been completely unintelligible yet? Good. Welcome to the video. Uh, welcome back to uh, <clears throat> the video. Boy, oh boy, I'm excited. Why? Because we get to uh, we get to pet the doggo like crazy. Hell yeah. Best thing in the update. Oh my goodness. I've had on good authority that they were uh, they were scrambling to add that feature at the end. Or something. Like, it was one of, one of the last features to be added because they needed it in the game, but apparently they were having issues with it. So, I think that it would have been a garbage update without... No, it... it, it Obviously, it's relatively inconsequential, but they, you know, the Can You Pet the Dog Twitter account, you know, they they gave it, they're effectively a, a out of two star review. Can you pet the dog or not? Is it good or is it bad, effectively? And, and they got a bad review. You can't pet the dog. They had to change it. Had to change it. And thank goodness they could. Because it's it's quite exciting. It's it's a it's a it's a minor change, but it's one of those little quality of life things that really does. It adds a, that je ne sais quoi, that extra little uh, something something, that flavor, that extra little flavor, the special seasoning, the character, if you will. I don't know. Let's just we can talk about it like it's a recipe. Just that that little extra seasoning, that je ne sais quoi, that uh, special ingredient. The thing that's good, there we go, that's more my speed. That thing that, you know, it, it, you can make a game and you can, it can have like, all, it can be feature complete, it can have everything that you set out for it to have, but if it doesn't have that base, or not the base, if it, if it doesn't have the extra polished layer, that layer that is the things that aren't necessary, but the things that make it memorable, or the things that give you that little extra feeling, wow. Wow! We love a big shotgun. We love a big shotgun. But yeah, if it doesn't have those things that give it that extra standout, that, that polished layer that will make you remember each little thing, you know? It's... It might not last. It might not be a, a game that people talk about in a couple of years' time. Like, the, the reason this update is so exciting, and, and it was such a big deal, I mean, like, for my channel and for the game, obviously, the whole shebang is because it has that extra thing. It has the extra level of polish that makes it special. It, it makes people stick around with it as opposed to another roguelike. Because it, you know, it there's a lot of roguelikes out there, a lot of roguelikes, a lot of twin-stick shooter roguelikes even, that have technically a lot of the same features, but like, the the features are all there, they work, they're creative, uh, you know, it feels accurate, like, it feels like you're doing what you want to do, but the thing that's taking it over the top is like, that that extra polish This is the sound design, the, the art style is consistent and clean, and it's like really like for for pixel art it's really dang up there you know like people like to harp on pixel art but pixel art of this quality is not a cop out at all pixel art of, of this quality is really really not a short not a shortcut in the same way that people think hallelujah it's been a while junkie boy it's been a while about dang time. We're gonna junk it all. We got a big shotgun and a junkie boy and we are all ready. Can you pet the junkin? Here we can pretend that we're petting the junkin right now, right? There. It it honestly it looks closer the, that we're... No, no, no. Get behind junkin. There. It, it looks like we're petting junkin. And the dog is just happy. Time to riot. I'm gonna start a new Twitter account. Can you pet the Junkin? You can't pet the Junkin. 
So good thing to know about the big shotgun is that it's uh, quite large. No, the, the thing to know about the big shotgun, if you press the reload button by shell bulletkin or basically like shotgun style enemies, you can actually reload them into your weapon. Like, yeah. And not only does that instantly kill them, which is bizarre already, but on top of that, it does give you ammo back, which is wild. Wild indeed. So, okay, thing to know about junk as well. Well, first of all, thing to know about junk, and if you're super gun initiated, you might not have even seen the, the son of a gun. So basically, he's a fam uh, familiar, a familiar, if you will, <laughs> that, uh, that scales off of how much junk you have. He's currently level one. And the more, if you get one more rank of junk, he gets himself a little shield, I think. Then he gets, a, I think, like a hat, maybe. Or maybe he gets the hat first, then the shield, then the sword or something. Basically, you, you start stacking him up. You get him to be really strong. By the time he is at, like, six or seven junk, I can't remember, he becomes pretty dang ridiculous. The question is, is it worth really junking every one of the chests, though? If we're talking, like, strength of run-wise... Probably not. Like, probably not. Unless you're junk. Uh, unless you're junking. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's true. But unless you're a robot. Oh man, it's gonna be hard to junk some of these. Because robot does get the extra five percent damage boost, so it's really valuable to get junking on a robot run. Because you get twice the reasons to get the junk. And a thing to note: if you are gun initiated and you are looking to get yourself the junky boy. You are more likely to get junk if you are holding one key, at least one key. I don't know. It, it jumps up the, the chance by, like, it's really unlikely to get junkin', but it's not that unlikely to get junk. Having a key jumps it up, like, an extra 20%. 20% or something crazy like that is wild. Like, you, you want to do it. I'm very happy we got the big shotgun, too. Like, it's such... It's one of the most satisfying freaking guns in the game like holy moly i forgot we had this are we not buffing up junkin we're buffing up the dog do we not buff up junkin maybe when he gets a sword we'll buff him up maybe he doesn't even he might not even do damage right now but the, maybe there's the dog hold on i'm confused oh junkin you better you better get buffed if that's a thing because we actually have a way to actually manipulate familiars right now, which is very infrequent. There's not a whole lot. I think we could have maybe reloaded that guy. There's, as far as I know, there's just this, this, and uh, the banner of command or the battle standard. Battle standard would be amazing, and it does show up in the shops relatively frequently. All right, just do it. Just do it. Don't even look back. Don't look back. It's only going to get harder. If we don't junk this, we'll have to junk a red chest, won't we? All right. So he's got a hat. He's got a shield. Okay. I just need to really do this for a moment. I need to have me playing a wholesome little ditty with my friends. was a tale of Junkin the Brave. He was a piece of trash. And then you get him more junk and then he's not so bad. There was a tale of Junkin the Brave. He would had a shield that would not fail. And then you got a lot more junk and then he became an angel all right back up there 
All right, so that's enough of that. I just, I had the urge the last time, but we didn't have any followers to give them any real bard's tale. I wish I had something scripted, but there we go. Bada bing, bada boom. It's as good as scripted, right? Right? Boom, boom, boom. There was. <laughs> no, I can't. <laughs> can't do it again. This seems like not a boss weapon in the slightest, but we don't really have one. Join my team. Join my team. Uh, I wonder if it buffs up the charmed enemies. That would be... That'd be pretty good. I mean, maybe we do this just to... Maybe this does indeed buff up Junkin, even though it doesn't look like it. Oh! oh. Do, do, do. All right. All right. Throw the needle. I love how it does turn down the music, though. I think that's something that's new in this update. I don't think the game's... The game did that before, which is... A little strange. Oh, brave Junkin beat up the silly little ad who had tears in his eye. He swiped him with his cool shield, and then the eye did die. All right, come on now. Bite my blood, bite my veins. I'm a fountain. I'm a drinking fountain. Drink up. Okay, we probably shouldn't, like, you know, die. At the same time, who cares, right? It's just a... Uh, it's just a game. Why well, you have to be alive? So there's a full heart in the boss room, too, though. Let's... Come on, we, got, we can do plenty. Vampire inflation's being thrown at us. We might as well. Good deal. Plenty? I think that's plenty. Might as well... We could go to the rat. We don't really have good... Ah, uh, well. Let's go to the rat. And Vlad. And Selene. Oh, oh. Holy moly. Acid reflux. All right. That should be plenty. Just got to make sure we go to the rat. Won't be the biggest deal, but... Anyway, let's answer a Discord question. It's a little bit earlier than we normally do. We should do it. Do it early. If you have a question you want answered in the video, pop into the Discord link in the description and ask away in the Rito Questions channel. Dadbot asks, I'm new to Enter the Gungeon, wondering where you're meant to look. Am I meant to look at my character and guess where I am, or meant to look at where they are? Oh, like, look at the bullets or look at the character? I mean, it's... I, I wish I could tell you. I think that I usually... I usually look at the enemies to, like, time out when their attacks are coming, but it really... I wouldn't be surprised if different people had different approaches to it. I really wouldn't. Like, I, I look at the enemies, but then if I know that there's bullets close to me, I might look at my character to do some, like, micro-dodging. Just, like, little shuffles. But as far as... I, I'd say normally, no. I, on average, it'd probably be uh, looking at the enemies, making sure I, I know which attacks are coming. Like this guy. I'm, I'm watching him to make sure I know when he's got that special blast coming out. Oh, can I make this jump? I'm not even going to bother. I don't know if I've ever seen that room before. What on what on earth? God, I love this song. It's so good. <laughs> I'm not even shooting it at an enemy. I'm just having a good old time. Where you at, kitty? Junkin knows. Whoop. Whoop. Oh, come on. Nice dodge, jerk. I need more chests. I need more junk. Hup. Hup. Oh, the, th the thing that's so nasty about Anvil, and, well, one, it seems like the, the, <laughs> the devs, like, 
made a mistake when they typed in the, the stats on it. Because it's so good. But two... On enemies that it doesn't kill in one hit, which are few and far between on this floor, it pushes them back and hits them again. Like, say what? Oh, he's got a sword. The brave Sir Junkin took up his sword. He swiped at the enemies till he was bored. All right. Somebody can clip that. Clip these all together. If, well, maybe I'll make a full ballad. We'll see. He is a brave man. He deserves it. This is the rat room. This is the rat room. Bloop is a madman. Let me talk about Spy Kids for a second. What on earth? Like, what on earth? I, I watched, like, two, two little clips of it. And I just... Oh my goodness. It is bizarre. Is that... Which one has Floop? Is that the first one? If you don't... If you're unfamiliar, like... Just Google or YouTube. Yeah, you're already on here. YouTube the, the floop scenes in Spy Kids. They're bizarre. They're so bizarre. Like actually scary for for me as an adult. No, not quite. But like, they are just a little unsettling. They're in that uncanny valley. You know what? Can we reload him? No. They're in that uncanny valley. That that area where it's like. The things going on are, like, human, but, like, there's finger men, men that are literally fingers, and then there's Fluke, who has fingery, twisty, a finger twisty head. I don't just, oh my god, get it out of my brain. Get it out of my brain. Cool. We'll take that. That's a free chest for our boy Junkin. I know it's going to be an open chest and everybody's going to be upset, but... This is the tale of Junkin the Brave. This is not the tale of Rito the Brave. Cool. Come on. Hey! Alright. And junk. 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 Not the best weapon for it. A top. Oh, wait, no, I don't like that one. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I gotta get into it again. Atop his head, there laid a plume. He walked the world where death now loomed. There we go. It's Brave Sir Junkin. You gotta give him the tail. You gotta spin him a web. He is our knight in shining armor. Our junk in shining armor. I mean, look at that plume. Him got him good. We're kinda stinking for items. Or for guns, rather. Our items, I mean, well, you could, I guess you could say that we're not doing the best we could for, uh, for items either. But I would never say that in front of my son, Junkin. Alright, well, we got a couple options, I'm guessing. Ooh, ooh, well, actually, I don't care. We don't need that, garbage. Okay, we go to Center Grace, right? We don't need an A key. I mean, we will hit the max cap at some point. No. Teapot. T for two. Oh! When Junkin's up there kicking their rumps, we can do damage in, in an AoE around him! Made, I'm so glad that I'm playing a, a sweet supporting role. Why is Junkin... Junkin, it doesn't count. That's, this is sickening. 
That's sickening. Junkin does not get the aura, and that is sad. And it doesn't even get the special loot. It doesn't seem like it. Doggy roll. Excuse me. I mean, I'm guessing that the synergy is just with the dog or just with... But maybe it's just with, like, all the familiars. Who knows? If it's supposed to be with all the familiars, then it's... It is, uh, sorely missed on Junkin. Yeah, this gun's like a... It's like a... It's fine. It's okay. It would be a 10 out of 10 if it could affect Junkin. It is noticeably better with the dog synergy, though. It doesn't normally set on fire, does it? Does it just, doesn't it just normally do damage? Uh-oh. We gotta be good with this, because we don't have a lot of ammo left. Oh. No, no. Gotta th I, am I gonna think of it? I, no, I feel like it has to be improv. He donned the cloak of dare not spoke. I, <laughs> I don't have any more. Cloak? Cape? He donned his cloak to vanquish his foes. <laughs> I don't got any more. I, a little bit is too much. Alright. Too much is too much. There you go, Junkin. That's the tale of your song. There you go. Got a whole whopping a couple verses for you, man. I don't got it. I don't got any more. Don't got any more of the rhyme with cloak. Cape. Cape could work too. That's on you, chat. Your, your job is to figure out this verse for me. What is the. Give me the best verse. Oh, he's got the spin attack. All right, I'll, I'll give him. I'll give him the verse he deserves. Cause that one's easy. With oh, with his cloak, he begun to spin. The enemies knew they'd surely not win. There, that one's easy. That one's a joke. That's the real verse. That's the real verse. Oh, oh my god. Why did we even go over there? Alright, I think we shall sling a bit. Bonus damage if we bounce off the wall. But... Not feeling it. Not feeling it. Can you spin attack what's not there? Can anyone truly spin attack what's not there? No! Honestly, we might be better off just aiming at him. Yeah. If you miss half your attacks, you're not gaining any damage. Also, there's no way I'm gonna correctly predict this every single time. Right? Oh, okay. Maybe I'm maybe I'm a god. I don't know. I forgot. Read of the god. That one might as well, though. Alright. Bada bing, bada boom. You did it, Junkin! Membrane is great, too. Uh, should I get the AK-47? Honestly, like... Maybe not. I know we we're going to the rat, don't worry. I don't know if I need it. Maybe I'll get the bracket key, though. I'm gonna get the bracket key. Sue me. Oops. I know we're gonna need another uh, another key before we start junking again, though. All right, all right. Let's answer another Discord question. Why don't we? Unkin Sneko. Okay. It looked like I landed on there, though. Can we talk about that? Asks. Oh wait. Also, Twitch Twitch subscriber. Very worth noting. Thank you so much. I was just wondering which of the table tech items you consider to be the best and the worst. Table tech blanks is very consistently banging. And so is table tech stun. Uh, other than that, like, I, I kind of find table tech money, money sight 
And what else is there for the middle? Money in sight to be in the middle, followed by maybe or maybe table tech heat even in the middle, followed by table tech shotgun and table tech rocket. I feel like I might be missing one. Up, up, down, right, down, up. Oh. What do you got? What do you got? Thank you. Actually, no. Nah. Okay, up, up. Oh, we really should have waited. Is it going to spawn the second phase or not? This is the one with the crazy second phase. Oh, okay, cool. Down, right. Down. Right. Down, up. Got him. God, that's crazy. Down, up, down, up, down, up. Whoo, Nelly. Bracket key and this big shotgun all at the same time. Gotta tell you. Ooh, it's very good. What do we even fill at this point? We're not really out of much of anything anymore. Whoops, I meant to switch to this one. I think that's the only thing we're running low on. Yeah, we could cheesy, cheesy push that in, but I don't think I feel like it. Okay. Is there better? No, I think that we use this here. And then on the next phase, we bring out the membrane. It'd be better value. We're pushing Junkin' around, like, a lot. He's not even getting in there. Okay. That's a bit of a downside. It's a very bit of a downside. Very big bit of a downside. Oh. Ah, <laughs> I got tricked. Get bamboozed. Oh hell. This is not going not going great. Don't like this. Don't like this. Don't like this. Junkin, I'm counting on you. There we go. We could have left at any moment, but it's okay. He did show up within 15 minutes though, so I'm not sure. Membrane! Start off with the, uh, bracket key, I'd say. Good morning. Nice. Nice. Is Junk... Where's Junkin? He's in there, I think. Right? He's underneath there? Where is he? I can't tell if he's under there attacking or not. He is. He's under there. I don't know if he's attacking, though. Ah! <laughs> He's not attacking, he's just sitting there. He's just sitting there. This is the tale of Junkin. The cowardly, I can't believe he'd do this to me. Ugh. Fight you coward, he's literally sitting right under his rump. On his rump. Come on. Oh, hell, I did it again. There we go. He's getting in the fight. He's in there. Yeah, Junkin. You got him. Nice. You, you, you redeemed yourself. Hello. Do an attack. Do a different attack. Thank you. Speed run. Orbitable. It's interesting. We could have a whole music array. I don't. I don't counter that anymore. I counted those all day though. Come on, give me that. Perfect. Give me that point. Perfect. Oh, man. 
Uh, that's I. That's the thing. I try that one and I don't get it. Ah, he he's got me. The ones with the cheese, man. The ones with the cheese. He leaves a lot more openings in the third phase. I know you can count on that one. It's not even that bad. But it's also really easy to get him with this. But I'm going to leave him at a little bit more health because I want to finish him off with the big boom. Oh, he might not let me. Don't do it again. Oh, okay, come on, man. All right, you did that to yourself. You did that to yourself. It's okay. I'm not going to take all his items anyway, so it doesn't really matter if we get the extra key or not. Ooh. Ooh. Oops. Oh. 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 Oops. We killed him. Pitch perfect. The green one? It's the green one. Oh. That is so cool looking. Pull my jacket. Is there synergy with that too? And what else did we even use? Membrane. Boom. Open them all up. Ba boom. Ba boom. Just for the hell of it. And then leave. Because I can. That's how I roll. I take the booties and go. Take them sweet Nikes and leave. So what do we get? We got orbital bullets, which actually are bad with membrane. Easy reload, which I don't really care about. Ooh. Uh oh. <laughs> that is so cool. Oh wait, we have the rat, rat boots. We just got those. Actual banger. <laughs> oh my goodness. You know what? For a moment, let's just turn it off. Junkin. It's all on you. It's a nice little ditty. Look, I'm so proud of him. I've never been more proud of anything ever in my life. Sad, but true. All right. My junkin' son. Oh. Right. Oh, brave Sir Junkin, he's donned in white, scaring any enemy who dare. Oh, brave Sir Junkin, donned in white, scared off enemies who dared to fight. There we go. Sweet man. Looking good. Honestly, I think this might be the best phase of Junkin that there is. Because I think this is the one that will blank, come to your aid and blank. And this, the next one is a little bit more uh, reclusive. He's kind of his, he's kind of a lone dog. He takes, takes control. He, uh, he goes off. He doesn't blank it, blank for you. This one's not blanking for me anyway. So maybe I'm wrong. I'm sad. But, but, I mean, I don't know. Maybe it is affecting Junkin. Oh, yeah. Thank you. He blanks for me. Oh. Get him, got him good. The aura, the, something about the, the music note aura, like, really works with this. It just looks like it's on purpose. Oh. 
I don't freaking know. What on earth? What on earth do- what- what- what are you- who are you? What is it- is this the Archangel form or something? The- the Valkyrie? I- I got nothing. I got nothing for Valkyrie. Or what- I'll have to- I'll have to sit in silence. And think about it. No. Let's just move on. If something comes to me, I'll- I'll, I'll do it. But I don't- I don't think I got one for this. Alright. Move it! Is it- oh, is this supposed to be Paladin? No, the second- the last phase is Paladin. The one prior. Oh my god, Junkin's shots go in my aura because of orbital bullets. Yeah, we still don't buff him up. At least not- it doesn't show it. That is insane that we get his shots. That is actually insane. Do you blank for us anymore, man? You blank for us? Ooh. Here, I don't know. I'll, I'll give it a swing. I'll give it a swing. That was the tale of Sir Junkin. <laughs> Got him. There we go. It's not a completed song, but, you know, who knows if any of those old bard's, t bard's tales were ever completed truly. Uh-oh. We got the orbital bullet bug. Bullets are frozen in time. Sorry, guys. I don't know what he said. Derringer. Okay. Easy enough. You just push him in the pit. If only we had... Oh, this is actually going to be really... Well, it would be annoying if it wasn't for Sir Junk and the Brave. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Should just shoot this at the wall and use it as a little orbital bullet. Is that, we can't even, we don't even get the orbital bullets from it? You gotta be kidding me. All right, all right, all right, all right. It's actually, oh, it's actually the AK, cool. All right, I don't think we get anything else. Let me just double check. Make sure they didn't, okay. I didn't know if maybe they would have added another thing. 16 is not bad at all. I didn't think that they added another one for him, but maybe. There is another form, and it is with golden junk. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So now it doesn't matter that if we blow him away, right? Look. I don't think it does, because he's going to be doing his AoE business regardless. We get hit. I think we did. I didn't know if it was Full Metal Jack or not, though. Yep, it was Full Metal Jacket. Hey, oh, cool deal, though. All right, is there anything of value here? Not really. We just gotta make sure we go and get the bullet that can kill the past on the next floor. That's the top priority. Skull asks, what is your favorite bullet upgrade? Fat bullet, silver bullet, shock rounds, etc. Um, hmm. Honestly, right now, I think it might be Helix bullets, unless Scattershot has been upgraded. I, I've been told it did, and I had a run where I thought it was, but I'm not so sure. Not so sure. It would be, it would be that. Otherwise, uh, yeah, I think... I think Helix bullets are pretty dang nice. They just, they always add a lot of fun and a lot of good value. And Helix Bullets are a lot easier to get all the shots with, so it's not as bothersome of a damage downgrade. Ooh. I can't believe we, oh, what the hell? I can't believe we actually get the shots from Junkin. Wild. Boop, 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 boop. We could just keep playing as if we are indeed inspiring Junkin, but I don't think he likes my tunes. Yeah. Bracket if you got him. We haven't been like 
strategically refilling as much as we should have. Yeah, this is so good and I'm wasting it. It's it's great. Alright. I wish we didn't lose the orbital bullets move between the rooms, but it's probably good for uh, you know, like performance reasons that it does. God dang it. I'm trying so hard to hit him with the aura. With my spinning green death ball. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Does it even green fire them or does it just hit them? It does green fire them. Good deal. Stupid. The good news is it really doesn't matter what happens to this run because we are going to the past, so we are definitely going to be fine. Oh! Fed Quan's done. We could try to junk for the golden, but... I ain't, I ain't afraid. Duncan, I need you! I ain't afraid. I don't need it. Uh, oh. oh, hell. I get you. Hear you loud and clear, Puppo. Okay. We, we maybe can even kill these guys with the little aura. Wow! Wow! This is crazy. If only we had Banner of Command today. That would be amazing. Battle standard. Oh, we can have all the little hearts falling around us. Reminds me of Undertale. It's a much less well-known uh, game. It was under. I, I think the game called Undertale stole a lot from it. Undertale. Oh, look at this. The hearts and the fire aura. This is like... Almost feels like how the gun should be. It works well. Delete them. Send them. Yep. Bracket key, if you don't know, it does make you get less money. It makes it so... Uh, That's kind of cute. Why are they breaking? Oh, because you can only have so many around you. You can only have so many spawned on the field at a time. Aw, oh, man. Well, that's pretty... You gotta admit that. That's pretty cool. Oh! And then we reload, and it makes them spin faster. It's not, like, good. It's cool. It's definitely not good. Oh, good, though. Hey, the Predator. I don't know exactly what this does. But I got it on stream. And it is... It is... I think it's pretty good. But kind of quirky. It homes in. It homes in at the end of the clip. It gives you invisibility, which in turn does give you the ability to steal. So it's immediately up a couple tiers from a normal gun. Not bad, not bad. I dig it, I dig it. All in all, it's just... It's not that great, though, I don't think. I like the ability to steal about as much as I... Oh, <laughs> like the gun itself. Maybe maybe even more than the gun itself. Shell. Shell. What you got, Goopy? I don't care about any of that. You know what? This could be kind of cute. Right? If we do... Oh, it... Okay. I thought that maybe we could have an aura of the crazy ball shots. We can. If only they didn't get destroyed when you walked through the door, though. That's, like, that's the killer. That's the thing that wrecks it all. Huh. What to use? We're definitely going to use the Bubble Blaster on the second phase, because it is insane. Oh, man, we can't bounce off the wall anymore. Get him with it. Get him with all of it. 
You know what? Orbit, orbital bullets with uh, snow bullets could be pretty insane. I'm guessing. Oh, get him, junkie boy. If only we also had the scouter. This is his final tale. Get him. Go get him. Come on, man. Uh, he's actually doing pretty darn good. I wish I could play it beautiful, a beautiful tune for you. But this is all I can do for you, man. <laughs> You're not attacking the right thing. You're not attacking the right thing. This is this is on you. Oh, dumb Sir Junkin doesn't know where to aim. The stupid little creature. I think it's lame. Not true. That's an abridged verse. Don't worry, it's not real. It's not canon. I'm trying. I'm trying to get it in two cycles. It's it's hard. This gun is not meant to do damage. Not meant to do damage. All right, well, we will get him the one way we know how, with music. He's actually junkin shooting correctly now. Got him. Weird. So weird. Without music. I can't. Uh, it's creepy to me. Got him. All right. Well, junkin. We got you where we needed to take you. You're coming with me again, I guess. All right, you're fine. You're fine. Shall we leave? Do we have the bullet? We got the bullet. All right. Nice seeing you, Junkin. I don't know if you're coming with me through these doors. I'm alone. There once was a tale of brave Cerrito. In to the past is where he went to go. It doesn't work. I can't do it without the music. It gives me the vibes, you know? Well, we do just gotta kill our past, and then we will unlock whatever- I don't know if I've seen the Hunter's new alt skin yet for the weapon. I've seen- I've seen the Convicts. That's the only one we don't have after this, if we- assuming we win. Hopefully I will. I, I think this one is one of the easier ones. Colt 45 is pretty banging. Oh, I can't hit the wolf. Well, that's ominous. <laughs> yep. Don't know what they're using this for, but I know it can be good. Welcome, you finally made it. Dr. Wolfenclaw, we meet again. Since you seem so interested in my work, I'm sure you'll be thrilled to assist me in my latest experiment. Never! You and your whole bogus religion are twisted. I'm here to stop you. It costs science a hundred years of advancement. I think not. Besides, I don't intend on making it optional. Oh, your new body isn't quite ready. I didn't expect you quite so soon. Don't worry, though. You'll be kept nice and fresh in one of these cryopods until then. Hoo -hoo 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 -hoo. No matter. Whatever he said. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. For a second, I thought that he was going to be invisible. Okay, so we got to attack the... Wait. I thought we had to attack the scientist man. Because he puts up a, some kind of shield. No? Apparently not. Yeah, this really is one of the easier ones. Oh, he's being buffed. Where are you at, scientist man? Well, the dog the dog is sicked on his heels, so we're all good. In fact, I think the scientist man is dead. Dr. Wolf. So easy. So easy compared to the other ones. Holy moly. You can just sit there and spam. Sick your dog on the doctor, man. Well, at least it's finally over. Come on, Junior. Let's get out of here. We did it. I wonder... We should have the, uh, the Junkin art now, right? We should. 
I know you do if you finish the game normally, like at the, the Lich or whatever. I don't know about the pass. Aw, oh, man! We don't get the Junkin portrait. Well, anyway, let's go and take a peek at this weapon here. See what the alt weapon skin looks like for the hunter. I feel like we gotta get in costume. All right. Mosey on in. And we get ourselves... Oh, I have seen this before. It, it looks a little magical. It's nice. I like it. It's not... It's not wild, like some of the... A couple of the other ones. But it's, it's like a nice, slightly magical upgrade. I dig it. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the tale of Brave Sir Junkin. Subscribe for more Enter the Gungeon. And subscribe with the hopes that Sir Junkin may one day return to us. Uh, follow on twitch.tv slash retromation if you want to catch me streaming Enter the Gungeon or more live. Join the Discord if you want to talk about Enter the Gungeon, learn about Enter the Gungeon, talk about my channel, talk about any game on my channel, anything like that, or just whatever the hell you want. Or to ask a question for the video. Link in the description for all that shabang. <laughs> I wasn't going to swear. I was going to say sh schnaz. But I didn't like that. Anyway, thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. See you next time.